Okay, right. Um, vlog number two. What I'm thinking today, I've had a video idea. I'm thinking we try some product photography and specifically some coffee photography. Now, this is a great way to expand your portfolio. And if you're going to cafes and stuff and offering your services, they tend to like having something to see and look at. So coffee photography is quite a good way to expand that portfolio and make a good impression and make a start to what could be um, a great career. You never know. So um, without further ado, let's hop into it. Okay, um, very awkward position for me. But this is the setup. I've got a table here, right here. And what I'm gonna fill it with is just random objects. So I've got this bottle with feathers in. This is quite a nice thing just to fill, fill some negative space. Um, it's always nice to have some greenery or different colors in. So I've got some plants here. I can go right here. That's always nice to have. And I've also got um, a brown a brown notebook, just, just this here. But this is nice because I can put this here, even though I just go to the edge of it, but then you've got something else in here. What you want is to fit the theme. So I'm going for a nice grungy theme here. So that's why we've got all these brown colors and I'm increasing some warmth. That's why I've got this warmth lighting here. I can add more lighting here. There's something like this and add some more warmth into it, which would be a great idea if I place it like that. Then I put the polarizing filter on, which means the light can't actually reflect off the table. I've got this nice bronze hand, I'm gonna call it. So that can go there. And then I'm just gonna collect a load of other stuff and actually put it around here. Okay, now I've got some just uh, normal coffee here and I'm just gonna sprinkle some around just to add a bit more texture into the ground area. You don't have to do much, just add a bit. Also, another thing, I have found these two candles laying around. I want to add them in, so I'm gonna actually put them here and light them. That means that it has more candle light coming through, which might make the image look even better. And I'm gonna put the coffee cup just here, and it's gonna be white, so it's gonna stand out from everything else. Just brought in the coffee, it's not the best. I am no uh, expert in making coffee. So, what I want to do is actually move some of the stuff around, just pushing this in here. Now, I think I get shooting, and we'll see how it turns out. Let's go. As you saw there, I managed to create some great photos out of just some everyday household products. This really proves that no matter where you are, you can get some good photos out of it. And this is a great way to expand your portfolio and demonstrate to cafe owners and large scale brands that you can actually do good product photography. Now you can do this with a range of things. I only did this with coffee because, well, why not? And it also means I now get to drink the coffee. I'll show you the edits, but for now, I think that's everything. Have a good one, peace.